Site Recovery Manager 8.3.1 will now preserve VM tags as part of failover. Let's take a look. We have two VMs here, each have a different set of tags. And if we look at the recovery site, we see that the placeholder VMs for those two do not have any tags associated with them. Now we'll take a look at the tag interface in the recovery site vCenter, and we'll see that there are no tags there other than the vSphere application tags that are created whenever we use vSphere application. Navigating to the site recovery interface, we pull up our recovery plan and we're going to run a test of our recovery plan. And what's going to happen after we run this test, as part of this process, we're going to check to see if the recovery site has the, the tags that our VMs are tagged with. And since it doesn't, it's going to add them. And then as part of the recovery process, tag those VMs with those tags. So you can see now the recovery site VMs are tagged appropriately. Now we're going to clean up that test. So we're going to remove those VMs from inventory and replace them with the placeholder VMs. And now we can see we're back to that state again where the placeholder VMs do not have any tags associated with them. One thing to keep in mind is that the tags are still in that recovery site vCenter and they'll be assigned to those VMs the next time they are tested or failed over.